Hey everybody, this is Drew, and I'm back again for another update on the Bell's Palsy. Today is day 70. Yes, it's been 10 weeks now since I've had Bell's Palsy, and uh, a lot of improvement, uh, still a lot to go, but uh, you know, we'll go real quick in, into the inventory. I think the eyebrows are just, you know, absolutely perfect. I love the eyebrows. Um, wrinkling the nose, you know, I'm still getting uh, not as many wrinkles on this side, but uh, it's getting better. Um, closing the eye is a lot easier to do. Blinking, um, sometimes it blinks, sometimes it doesn't. So, you know, we're still struggling with that. Um, as far as the, the smile, you know, a little smile, looks like that. Big smile, there's the big smile. And uh, things are starting to get better, seeing a few more uh, bits of enamel there on the teeth. Um, hearing, you know, is kind of off and on. I'll go two or three days without any hearing problems, and then all of a sudden uh, I'll start getting that, that pounding in the ear again where you, where you hear uh, uh, with, with loud, high noises like dishes and so on. Um, but for the most part, it seems like things are still improving, uh, still need to improve a little bit more. But um, I, can, I can almost eat sandwiches now because when I bite, this lip doesn't seem to go under the tooth quite as much. So, uh, you know, things are getting better along that, that line. Um, I think I have a cold on, on this side of my face. Uh, it's not affecting this side at all, but, but my nose is a little stuffy here. My eye is watery on this side. My ear is plugged up over here. And my throat is sore only on this side. So I don't know if that has anything to do with the Bell's palsy or not. But, uh, you know, thank goodness it's not the whole face, right? <clears throat> um, I guess that's about it, really. Just... Uh, you know, keep keep hanging in there if you've got this. Uh, appreciate the small improvements, and uh, you know, just uh, just keep a real positive attitude about things. Um, they say that stress, you know, really affects this. And uh, yesterday was a real stressful day. Um, I found out my my mother, who is uh, uh, 76 years old, she uh, was taken to the hospital. A lot of internal bleeding, uh, broke her arm. She, she had a little tumble there at her apartment. And, uh, and so the, that was, uh, made it kind of a stressful day. Had to go into surgery and everything. But uh, she's doing a lot better today. And, uh, you know, I think uh, things are going to improve, you know, just, just all around. Um, as far as, you know, my mouth, I just wanted to let you know, the muscles are still real tight over here and uh, a little bit tight up here, still getting a few spasms and twitches, but I think that's normal. So uh, anyway, you know, good improvement, and uh, hopefully uh, by the end of next month, I was hoping by the end of this month, but nah, not quite there. So hopefully by the end of next month, um, we'll see a lot of improvement, and uh, if you've got this, like I said, just keep hanging in there. You may be doing better than I am, you may be doing a little worse than I am, but um, just, you know, keep that positive attitude. And uh, I'll post another one at week 11, uh, and we'll see, we'll see where we are, all right? So until uh, day 77, until week 11, this is Drew. Hang in there.